Hey, what's going on, Hood Nation? It is yours truly, TJ Jones, the host of the State of the Saints podcast. And for a few minutes, I want to talk a little bit about the New Orleans Saints and San Francisco 49ers game. If you checked out my last video, um, I said throughout the week, I'm going to basically be doing tail of the tape type videos where we kind of compare uh, both teams in, in different positions. Um, today, uh, we want to focus on coaching. Uh, you have two really good coaches. You have for the San Francisco 49ers, you have Kyle Shanahan. And for the New Orleans Saints, you have Sean Payton. Two offensive minds, uh, well respected around the league for their, their offensive play calling. Um, we all know about Kyle Shanahan. I mean, he was the offensive coordinator for the Atlanta Falcons when they had their Super Bowl run. And um, he made Matt Ryan the MVP. Uh, so, I mean, Kyle Shanahan has been around the league for a long time as an offensive coordinator. Um, not Never really had his opportunity at being a head coach. Um, we know that he uh, coached alongside his father. His father was the head coach, Mike Shanahan of the Washington Redskins. Uh, he also was the offensive coordinator when Rex Ryan was up in New York for the Jets. So this guy has been around. He's seen a lot of things. And honestly, uh, you know, I, I can see why um, the San Francisco 49ers on offense are as explosive as they have been this season. Uh, with the New Orleans Saints, we know Sean Payton is a great play caller. Uh, he has been uh, for a long time, you know, starting out with, you know, the New York Giants back in the day with Jim Fossil. And then, you know, Bill Parcells with the Cowboys and getting his head coaching job with the New Orleans Saints and has been here for about 13 years. So when you combine these two guys, um, if I'm trying to, uh, you know, I guess compare the two, who would have the edge? You have to say it's Sean Payton because of his coaching experience. I mean, we all know that Sean Payton, I mean, he has a Super Bowl winning coach. Uh, but um, one thing that I feel like that Kyle Shanahan does better uh, then Sean Payton, that is sticking to the run game. Uh, you know, the San Francisco 49ers last week had over 160 yards rushing uh, in a game against the Baltimore Ravens. Uh, you know, when you got a team that can run the football, when you have a team that is committed to the run, uh, when you have a team that doesn't shy away from it just because the yards are ugly, um, you're going to get success. Um, that, I mean, that's just the key. So Kyle Shanahan does a good job at – running a football, setting up the play action for the explosive plays. Sean Payton is a good play caller. I feel like he can be, um, you know, one of the all-time greats if he was to run the football a little bit more. Um, he he does a really good job, him and Mickey Loomis and uh, coaching staff, at getting guys in on the offensive line, guys that can be elite offensive line, linemen and mention among the greats, in my opinion. Uh, but, you know, running a football is one of those things that I feel like he lacks, uh, you know, when it comes to the play calling. Um, he wants to throw the ball all around the place. And I feel like when you're doing that, you make your team a little bit more predictable. And not to mention, um, you're not helping your team either because you're stopping the clock, especially when the, the team has a lead late. Uh, when it all comes down to it, um, both guys... Uh, have what it takes to be uh, Super Bowl champions. Um, Sean Payton once again for the second time. But uh, I'm going to give the edge to Sean Payton because I feel like Sean Payton, uh, you know, has been doing it for a longer time, uh, you know, and he uh, has that experience in some of these uh, crucial games. And both of these guys are going to have to be on their A game and, you know, going into this big matchup. They're going to have to uh, uh, really – um, have their, their, their pulse on the game and making sure that they're making the right decisions because, quite honestly, I don't think this one of them games where a team going to get blow out, you know, blown out or, you know, a team going to get destroyed. I think this is going to be nip and tuck throughout the entire game, and it might come down to decision-making, you know, rather it be that, that crucial timeout, rather it be that challenge, rather it be, um, you know, that run of that pass. So, um, I'm going to give the edge to Sean Payton on that because of his experience, but Kyle Shanahan isn't a slouch, and uh, we know that he can uh, put up some big numbers. Uh, we've seen him do it when he was the offensive coordinator uh, for the Atlanta Falcons. But what do you all think? What do you think about the coaching, uh, about Kyle Shanahan and uh, Sean Payton? Who you think has the edge? Uh, comment down below, like and share this video. This has been a State of the Saints podcast. Uh, please subscribe to the YouTube channel, youtube.com, search the State of the Saints podcast, 
And also on Facebook, facebook.com search State of the Saints podcast. Till next time, all I got to say is, who that?